Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. So today is a Sunday, which means that we're back at CVS to go over the best CVS deals of the week. There are a decent amount of really good deals, so I'm excited to get into it. And if you guys are new to my channel, you might not know that I do only digital couponing deals. So anybody can do these deals, whether you're a beginner or you've been couponing for a really long time. I use digital coupons and printable coupons from coupons.com. So if I am referencing a printable coupon, I will make sure to let you guys know where you can currently get it. And before we get started, I wanted to let you guys know that if you are submitting your receipts into Fetch Rewards, every single receipt where your receipts convert for points that you can redeem for gift cards, make sure you're also submitting them to Maryfield as well. Mary Maryfield is more so for healthy and organic brands, but they actually give you more points per receipt for any receipt than Fetch does. Plus you get a $2 bonus gift card just for signing up with my link in the description box down below. I'll also have it in the pinned comment. So that's really awesome. And on top of all that, Maryfield also has a better conversion rate than Fetch. So it costs less points to redeem for gift cards on Maryfield versus Fetch. So without further ado, let's get into the video. First up, we have an awesome deal on Clairol hair color, the regular hair color, the nice and easy, as well as the root touch-up. These are $9.29 at my store, which is really highly priced, which is probably cheaper, and they're buy two, get back a $4 extra buck. We have three new digital coupons, and two of those digital coupons are going to work together on the purchase of two of these. So what you're going to want to do is grab two of them at $9.29, totaling $18.58. I have a 4 off 16 hair color CRT that I got last week. It is expiring today, but CVS CRTs will scan up to two days expired, so I'm going to use that 4 off 16. And then we have two separate digital coupons that are going to work together, a buy one, get one free, which is a $7.99 off of two digital coupon, which should double dip and work with the $5 off of two digital coupon. We also have a $2 off one digital coupon, but I did not clip that coupon. I would recommend just not clipping it so it doesn't cause you any complications at checkout. After all, those those three coupons you should be left to pay a dollar fifty nine but you're gonna earn back your four dollar extra buck on your purchase of the two of them making your final cost free plus a two dollar and forty one cent money maker and even if you didn't have that four off sixteen hair color CRT your total for two of them would still just be a dollar and fifty nine cents which is really good Next up, we have a deal on Dove Body Wash. This is a decent deal. The Dove Body Wash are priced at $8.99 at my store. They're buy two, get back a $2 extra buck. And we have two separate digital coupons that are, again, like the Clairol, going to both come off on the purchase of the two of those. The first one we have is a $6.99 off of two digital coupon. And then we also have a $2 off one digital coupon. So both of those should come off at the register. You're going to be left to pay $8.99 for two of them, but then you're going to earn back your $2 extra buck, making your final cost just $6.99 for two bottles or about $3.49 each, which is a decent deal for Dove Body Wash. Plus, you can submit your receipt to Fetch Rewards to get some bonus points since Dove is a Unilever brand. Next, I'm going to be picking up two of these Skin to Mint razors. These are buy one, get one 50% off this week and buy two, get back a $3 extra buck. At my store, these are priced at $9.99 each, so two of these will cost me $14.98. I'm going to use a 3 off 15 Skin to Mint CRT that I got last week on a couple of my cards. With a 98% rule, I'm at least 98% of the way to the $15 spend limit to use my 3 out of 15 Skin to Mint CRT. And again, CVS CRTs do scan up to two days expired, so you can use last week's CVS CRTs the following week as long as you use them pretty quickly. Along with that CRT, I'm also using two separate $3 printable coupons from coupons.com that just became available today, the day I'm filming this, on July 16th. So with the 3 out of 15 CRT and the two printable coupons, I should be left to pay $5.98, but I'm going to earn back my $3 extra buck, making my final cost $2.98 for the two of these. And if you want to do this deal all digital, you can. You can use a digital coupon, a $3 digital coupon for one of the razors. And then for the second one that you didn't use a coupon for, you can submit to the Shop Me and Rebate app for $3 back. So that'll make your final cost, again, still $2.98 as long as you have the 3 out of 15 CRT. Next, we have a super awesome deal on Degree Dry Spray Deodorant. The men's or the women's are priced at $7.79. My store, again, is priced really high. Your store may be priced a little bit cheaper. They're buy one, get one 50% off, and buy two, get back a $3 extra buck. And we have a couple digital coupons that are, again, going to be stacking together. I feel like the theme of this week are two separate digital coupons that stack together on the purchase of two items. First, we have a four off two digital coupon, and then we have a $2.50 off of one digital coupon. Both of those 
will work together and both come off as long as you have both of them clipped. I also have a $1.50 off one degree digital coupon clip, so we have a total of three of them. I'll end up seeing at the register which two come off on the purchase of two of these. We'll have to see, but if it's the four off two and the two fifty off one, I should be left to pay five eighteen. But I'm gonna earn back my three dollar extra buck on the purchase of two of them. Plus, I can submit to Fetch Rewards for two thousand points back, which is approximately equivalent to two dollars back when I spend ten on degree products. And sometimes Fetch acts a little bit funny when you have coupons, so we'll end up seeing how much my degree tracks for after all the coupons. Coupons, but if I also get back that two dollars from Fetch Rewards, that would make my final cost just 18 cents for the two degree dry sprays. Again this week we have a deal on Revlon Cosmetics. This week they're buy two get back a five dollar extra buck and we have another instant CRT which is again a value of five dollars. So if you hung on to your five dollar Revlon CRT from last week and you now have the five dollar from this week you're gonna have an awesome deal on your hands. So you're gonna want to grab two of the Revlon eyeliners priced at $8.29. They're the color stay ones totaling $16.58. You're going to use those two $5 CRTs, and again, CBS CRTs will scan up to two days expired. After that, you'll be left to pay $6.58, but you're going to earn back your $5 extra buck on the purchase of the two of them, and then you can submit to the Ibotta rebate app for $3 back on each one that you bought, getting a total of $6 back from Ibotta, making your final cost for the two of these free plus a $4.42 moneymaker, and we can use that overage to cover some other products that are not free in our CVS haul today, and if you guys don't already have the Ibotta rebate app, it's linked in the description box down below to get a $5 bonus when you sign up and submit for your first I bought an offer like the Revlon deal. Another thing I wanted to share with you guys is right now you guys can get a forever lifetime subscription to Microsoft Office, the 2021 version for just $40. If you guys know anything about Microsoft Office, you know that normally you have to pay a yearly fee for it. And yes, it does continue to update every single year, but not much changes, honestly, with the Microsoft Excel and Microsoft Word, PowerPoint and Teams and OneNote, I think. Um, I used to use just Google Sheets, but it's not compatible with a lot of files. And I honestly just prefer Excel and Word, the originals. And I was really tired of paying for the yearly membership that's like $100 every single year. So linked in the description box and in the pinned comment, you guys can get a lifetime membership of the 2021 version of Microsoft Office for a $40 flat fee and never have to pay a yearly membership again. I scored that for my Microsoft for my MacBook Pro because before that I was getting it free with my tuition when I was in college, but now I don't have that anymore. So I wanted to have that forever membership to Microsoft Office. So again, link in the description box down below if you guys want to score that deal. L'Oreal Elvi products are buy two and get back a $4 extra buck this week. At my store, they're priced a little bit high at $5.79. I'm going to be picking up two of these totaling $11.58 and using a 3 off 2 printable coupon from coupons.com that was available last week that is still available to print if you have not already printed it. And as long as your cashier scans that 3 off 2 printable coupon before they hit total when the digital coupons come off, a 3 off 2 digital will also double dip and come off that we have available, making your final cost $5. 58 but you're going to earn back that four dollar extra buck on the two of them making your final cost just a dollar and 58 cents for both but again your store's probably cheaper so yours will be closer to free Colgate Optic White products, including the Optic White Renewal Expensive Toothpaste or Spend 20, get back a $10 extra buck. So you, one thing that you could do is grab two of the Colgate Optic White Renewal at my store. They're priced very high at $11.29, totaling $22.58. You could use a 3 off 18 Colgate CRT, and then we have two digital coupons that are going to work together on the purchase of two of these, a $3 off one for the Colgate Optic White Renewal, and a 3 off two any Colgate toothpaste. So that would leave you to pay $13.58, earning back your $10 extra buck, making your final cost just $3.58 for the two toothpaste. A better way to do the deal would be to grab one of the Colgate Optic White Renewal at $11.29 and then grab one of the big Colgate Optic White Advanced toothpaste priced at $9.19. Both of these are included in the spend 20 get 10. That will total you $20.48 so you'd be much closer to the $20 spend limit to get back 10 versus getting two of the Optic White Renewal would push you way over. You're going to again use the 3F18 Colgate CRT, the 3F1 Colgate Optic White Renewal digital coupon that'll double dip with the 3F2 Colgate toothpaste digital coupon and you'd be left to pay $11.48. Earning back your $10 extra buck would make your final cost just $1.48 for the two nicer, more expensive toothpaste. 
Next, we have a deal on the Copper Tone Sunscreen. Copper Tone Sunscreen are spend 20, get a $10 extra buck, which is already 50% off. The cheapest ones at my store are $11.29, so grabbing two of those would total me $22.58. I have a 3 off 9 sunscreen CRT that I got in a CVS email. Make sure you're always checking your CVS emails for any CVS store coupons that you can send to cart. Sometimes they're kind of hidden in the bottom of the email, so make sure to check all of them. And then I'm also going to be using two separate $2 printable coupons from coupons.com that were available a couple weeks ago so I really recommend always printing all the printable coupons from coupons.com or just saving them as a pdf so you can print them when you need them if you do end up needing them. So with those two $2 printable coupons I should be left to pay $15.58 earning back my $10 extra buck making my final cost just $5.58 for two sunscreens. If you have copper tone products priced closer to $9.99 or $10 you'd want to grab two of those and that would make your cost significantly cheaper since you wouldn't be way over the $20 $20 spend limit. Neutrogena Facial Care are spend 20 get back an $8 extra buck. So one way you could do the deal is by grabbing three of the $6.99 priced Neutrogena cleansers totaling $20.97. I don't have like a 5 off 20 Neutrogena CRT this week. My accounts didn't get almost any CRTs this week and I realized I didn't have any from last week to use either that I could use a couple days expired. So that was really unfortunate but if you do have like a 5 off 20 skincare or 5 off 20 Neutrogena or Aveeno facial care CRT that would be amazing for this deal. If you do have that CRT you'd use that. I also had a $3 off any acne skincare CRT that I got in one of my CVS emails so you could also throw that into the mix and then if you have some of these older $2 printable coupons for Neutrogena facial care that are not yet expired if you saved them and printed them from coupons.com a couple weeks ago you could use two of those $2 printable coupons and then there's also a digital coupon as well for $2 off so if you use all those together you'd end up paying $6.97 earning back your $8 extra buck that would already make it a dollar and three cent money maker but then you can also submit for the new activate rewards a back to school rebate for when you spend 20 on select Neutrogena, Aveeno, all Johnson & Johnson products, you get back a $5 Visa gift card, which you can use to purchase products however you want, or you could buy a gift card with that $5 Visa gift card for CVS or Amazon or wherever you like. So that would actually make your final cost a $6.03 money maker. And if you don't have some of those CRTs, it would still end up being a really good deal. Even if you didn't have the 5 off 20, that would still make it a dollar and three cent money maker. Even if you didn't have the 5 off 20 or the $3 acne CRT, but you have the printable and digital coupon, then that would make it just a cost of like two dollars so that really wouldn't be bad at all and i'll have the activate rewards linked in the description box down below so you guys can easily find that rebate. Since I don't have any of the Aveeno CRTs or Neutrogena CRTs, I'm going to grab this Aveeno Facial Bar for $3.29 and use my 3 off Acne CRT that I got from my CVS emails on this instead of doing the whole Neutrogena deal this week. All right, so transaction number one, um, I grabbed the Skin Timid Razors, a Neutrogena soap that was supposed to be $3.29, but I guess it rang up at $3.79, and that was for my $3 acne CRT I had for my CVS email list email, and then I did two of the Clairol products at $9.29. I used two $3 printables from coupons.com that are still available for the Skin Timid Women's Disposable Razors, both the $7.99 off of two BOGO coupon, digital coupon for the Clairol, and the 5 off 2 digital. Did both double dip and come off? I did not have the 2 off 1 Clairol digital clipped, so I'm not sure if you have that one clipped, if that'll change anything but for me just having these two clipped worked and they both came off for crts i had a 4 off 16 hair color crt from last week a 3 off 15 skin timid crt from last week both of those were i believe one day expired they'll scan up to two days expired and then my three off acne crt from my cvs email list emails and i did the math wrong and i thought i would owe over ten dollars after all my coupons so i handed over my ten dollars and extra bucks that i had a five a three and a two but I guess I only owed like $8.36 after all my coupons. So my $2 I adjusted down to $0.36, cents, which sucks. I'm just uh, going to count that I spent out $8 in this transaction since you would only have to spend out $8 in cash or extra bucks on this transaction. But then you get back $7 in extra bucks, three for buying two of the Skin Timid, and four for buying two of the Clairol Hair Color, making your final cost just $1 for this transaction, which is great. And then you can submit your receipt to Care Club for the Johnson & Johnson product, which is a Neutrogena product to convert your receipt for points that redeems for gift cards. It works the same as pggoodeveryday.com. Both of those are linked in the description box down below. 
Transaction number two was the copper tone and your copper tone at your store may be cheaper. So you might find some around $9.99 each. If you find them for around $10 each, pick up two of those and then you'll hit your spend 20, get 10 and you'll owe less money than I did. But at my store, the cheapest ones were $11.29. So I grabbed two of those, used two $2 printable coupons that were available on coupons.com a couple weeks ago that were not expired yet. So hopefully you print or save as a PDF all your coupons.com coupons every single week um, <clears throat> so that you can use them when when you need them. And then I had a three off nine sun care CRT that I used that was an email list email uh, coupon. So make sure you're always checking your CVS emails and sending to cart all the coupons you get in those. And then I use $7 and extra bucks to pay. Um, and then about an $8 subtotal I put on a Maryfield gift card. So $15 out of pocket, but got back 10 for spending 20 on copper tone, making my final cost for two of these sunscreens, just $10 or just $5, just $5 for two of them, which is not bad considering they're $11.29 regularly priced. And I'm excited because these don't expire till summer 2025. So these will be good for another almost two years. And my final transaction was my biggest one. I grabbed the Degree Dry Spray Deodorant. I tested out that deal for you guys. And then I also grabbed the L'Oreal L-Vive um, shampoo and conditioner. And then I grabbed two of the Revlon eyeliners at $8.29. For coupons, I used a 3 up 2 printable coupon for L'Oreal L-Vive that I believe is still available on coupons.com that came out last week. And then that double dipped with the 3 up 2 digital coupon as long as you scan all your paper coupons before the cashier hits total when the digital coupons apply that will double dip and come off and then I can confirm that both the 4 off 2 degree dry spray digital coupon and the new 250 off 1 degree dry spray digital coupon both will double dip and come off together even if you have that $1.50 digital coupon also clipped they take off both the higher value coupons first which is amazing and then I have my two $5 Revlon CRTs one that I saved from last week that's one day expired they scan up to two days expired and then one that we got this week, so $10 off of the Revlon eyeliners. I used a $10 extra buck that I had, put the rest around $7 on a Fetch Rewards gift card. So $17 out of pocket, but I got back a total of $20 from extra bucks and rebate apps. It was $12 in extra bucks, um, five for buying two of the Revlon products, four for buying two of the L'Oreal L5 products, yes, and three for buying two of the Degree um, dry spray deodorant so for a total of $12 and extra bucks back and then I also got back $2 from fetch for the spend 10 on degree dry spray deodorants get back 2,000 points which is around equivalent to $2 technically I didn't hit the spend um, 10 with all of my coupons but it did count so that's great so you can submit your receipt to fetch to get some bonus points and then I also submitted my receipt to Ibotta and got back $3 for each of the Revlon eyeliners, getting back a total of $6 there. So spent out $17 total, got back $20, making this transaction a $3 moneymaker. So from all my transactions today, my final cost for all three is just $3, which is awesome for everything that I got. So I hope you guys enjoyed this week's CBS All Digital Couponing Deals video. Make sure to download Maryfield with the link in the description box down below and check out that Microsoft Office $40 for a forever license of Microsoft Office 2021. That is an amazing deal. I did score that for myself as well. I'll have that linked in the description box in the pinned comment and I will catch you guys in the next one.